We're going to use a very small amount of onion. Again, we have a jalapeno that uh, uh, we've seen in better days. Right now, he's going into the bowl with the onion. All right, we've got our onion and our jalapeno. We're going to add about half of this cilantro. Now we have our onion, our jalapeno, and our cilantro. You'll notice the mango is flatter, wider. This section right here in the middle is a giant flat seed. So we need to cut around that seed. So we're going to cut the smallest side first. And we're going to go right around the edge of that seed. which uh, we did not do because I cut too close to the center. I was supposed to cut a little bit farther off to the right because I want to go down beside the seed, not to the seed. I want to miss the seed. Boy, this is getting butchered up like you can't believe. There, see, there's your seed that you want to avoid. And there is the meat that you want. So, let's try this other way. See that seed? Look how far down that goes. That's a piece of cilantro. See that seed there? Why didn't we peel it first? Well, because there's a reason we didn't. cutting too close to the center. I want to cut farther away from the center so that it goes down beside the seed like so. Now we have three pieces. We've got our two sides and then we have our center. The center has got the seed in it. We're going to pull out another knife. Perry knife will be very handy for this. We're going to go in and we're going to cut. I just messed up because I went too far and I cut the skin. Don't want to cut the skin. You want to cut deep enough in to stop before you get to the skin. This was too far. You see that? That's too, too, too far. So we're going to try to salvage that. And of course, the day that I don't have gloves, I could have blood on everything, right? Right. You see what's happening here? See that? Now we're going to fold that inside out. There's all your mango flesh. Yum, yum, yum. Now, it should be very easy. Just simply cut that right off the skin, and you have diced mango. Alright, let's try this again. Right on down to the peel, but not through the peel. Ah, right there, just went right through. That's what I get for having a sharp knife.
Okay, we're back to our mango jalapeno salsa. In the bowl here, we have our jalapenos, our mango, our sweet onion, and some cilantro. We're going to do just a tiny amount of salt and pepper. That's a, not even an eighth of a teaspoon there. Probably an eighth of a teaspoon here. Just a very tiny amount. Oops. Very tiny amount of cumin. Let's hope that the pineapple gives us that sweetness and a little bit more of that juice that we need. Mm. Pineapple does it. Our mango and pineapple salsa 